Hello and welcome back to Cabin Ceramics. If you watched my last video, you'll know that I did a video on my first kiln. So my work turned out really well. Really pleased with the bits firing. So today I'm gonna to show you how I glaze my work. First of all, I'm gonna show you how to glaze the inside. So I'm gonna be using some transparent glaze. This is from Pottery Crafts. They do some really nice um, glazes. On this vessel, I'm gonna do the transparent glaze. Safety first, always make sure when you're glazing that you are wearing a pair of gloves. For one of the vessels, I'm gonna use the transparent so you do need to mix that with water so you want to get it to a single clean consistency give it a good stir make sure you get all the lumps out i always glaze the inside of my work first and the reason for that is because then i can leave it drying inside and be working on the outside so i use a lot of illustration in my work so i tend to draw a lot using the under under glaze paints so what I want to do is just tip that right in. We'll fill it right to the top. And then just leave it for about 10 to 15 seconds. Look around, make sure that's all covered. So you want to pour this out as quickly as you can, just like that. And then what I'll do is just leave that upside down for a few minutes. What I do with all my pieces is I always sand them down and I'm using the P120 sandpaper. Usually put a pot underneath just to collect any dust and I usually have a mask on. have a little bit of an experiment with this one. I have no idea if it's going to turn out. I'm just going to use a little bit of sponge with the red and just wipe that across the print. Let's see what that looks like. Hmm. Oh, it's blustering. Oops. A little bit too I mean that looks a little bit of a mess, but what I'm going to show you next to do next is if you start to wipe this away, so get the dry part of the sponge, it must have been wet, and just wipe, wipe that away, yeah, so that looks really nice inside the lettering now. I'm also going to use the Pottery Craft Transparent Brush on Glaze onto these lovely Christmas ornaments. And in between each coat, you wanna wait 10 minutes. Yay, look at that, that looks nice. Ooh, so let's take a look how it's turned out. Ooh, nice colors. These pieces are fired overnight. It's my first glaze firing in my new kiln. I've decided to call the kiln, Kimmy the Kiln. And that's because I like the TV programme, Unbreakable. So look, look how shiny everything's come out. I'm really, really pleased with everything. Can you see that there? Okay, so the transparent glaze from Pottery Crafts looks fab so shiny so lovely if you are new to my channel hit the subscribe button and i'll see you in the next video oh and the next video is going to be on ceramic jewelry making so if you can see that there i'm going to show you how to make these pendants and these lovely earrings 
Okay, thanks for watching. Bye for now.